We can't land a hit like this! Ray, Rose, don't worry about me! <laughs> There's no shame in running. But when you do, there might not be any trace of your beloved sage left. <laughs> Scarlet Flash, Red Arrow! Ray! Huh. Got it. <laughs> you think you can take me out with just that? Uh. Rose! Are you okay? Don't let up on the attack! I'll kill you both at once! Element Flash! In this situation, what should we do? We'll counterattack. Uh, uh, Rose! I don't mean we're going in without a plan. I've learned her attack patterns. That shield is a sword. A sword that you mustn't touch. What it means is that you don't need to hit the shield to counterattack. We can do it! The two of us! You've got a really level head, Rose. You never give up, no matter what. <laughs> you crafty little rats! Ray, now! I'll slice off her shield arm! What? Uh. Camellia! What good timing! I'll leave that one to you. Ciela! Ray! Leave Ciela to me. Ray? Let's settle this. Keep kissing me off, but there's no way I can lose in a situation like this. Rose, I command you to disregard me and attack. If you die, Ray will be sad. Then you shall die in peace. Ray, I didn't know you were alive. Camellia. It was all a lie, wasn't it? We all trusted you. I will never forget the kindness you all showed to me. Then why? Mr. Himmel and Miss Arcus! They had no choice. It was all so we could build a world for humans. So you're just like Azalea? Ray, you may not understand, but... Even if it was only a few short years, Azalea and I were born at the same time. She's my other half who shared the same life. I can't turn my back on her. So we can't come to an understanding? What's the point in that? <sighs> Coming to an understanding and sharing a life are two different things. Understanding each other is ultimately pointless. Ray, the difference in our strengths should be obvious. I don't want to have to cut you down. Give it up! And you can do as we tell you. I just... can't do that. There's no way I can approve of the world you envision. Why are you crying? Are you trying to beg for mercy? I'm not. I came knowing that all this would happen. What the hell are you talking about? I knew that I'd fight you. And that it might all end in tragedy. You must have felt that too, right? That's why you care so much about me. And if you feel that way, then we can come to an understanding. Camellia! <laughs> uh. 
Like I said, there's no point in trying to understand each other. You're wrong. Understanding the other person, understanding each other. If you close yourself off from that, then you can't call yourself human anymore. <sighs> Isalea was right about you. You are so irritating. That's exactly what annoys me. This is what we need to do for our world. Camellia. Ray, we've come to save you. Who? No, that voice. Aileron? Pylon is with me too. We found this under the museum. This is a robot for use by Sky Striker Aces. But it won't do anything. That's because there aren't any programs installed. We might be able to start it with my program. No, I don't have enough capacity to start the system up. If only there was one more of me. Pylon. Uh, no, you can't. Once we install ourselves, our two programs will merge into one. And your program will just become a part of mine. We'll never be able to get you back. Pylon will always be with Aileron. <sighs> Pylon? I always felt it was kind of weird from one machine to another, so I never said it out loud, but... I've always loved you. I know. Uh-huh? Really? Yeah, I've always felt that from you. Mm, embarrassing. Hey, can we hug until the end? Of course, as tight as we can. Don't ever forget me. Adult Saber, activate. Done. Come on, Ray. Ciela said, said the same, same thing to you when you became a Sky Striker Ace, didn't she? We wanted to do everything we could to help you, and with this, I'll be together with Pylon forever. 